Tim Peters of Money Talk here back at you with another video. And today I'm going to talk about Carvana. So right now, is it a good buy right now? So Carvana is $35 and a year ago, a year from the day, it was like 10 times that much. Sound like a good buy, does it guys? Well, when you think about it, why would a company go down in shares 90% why would they in a single year think you got to just think back at the company why is the company doing bad if it is why is it doing bad and the company is doing bad they get like a lot of complaints with Carvana I believe that somebody's complaining that they, that they couldn't get like a title I think it's either a title or a tag maybe it was both of them they even wait for like over a year And Carvana, the customer serve for Carvana, Carvana will not help them. So that is a red flag. I was considering buying the car from Carvana, but now I'm staying away from that. I'm not going anywhere near Carvana for, for a while. So I was a consistent customer, but now I'm good. I'm just going to stay away from it. But is it a good buy? I mean, let's say you bought 10 shares right now. So it's $35, which means you spend like $350. If those shares, if Carvana's able to turn around and the shares go back up to like $350, you get yourself three grand in profit. But those shares like go down to like the one digits, then zero, and, and the company just goes bankrupt. You lose that money. So there's risk in life. Sometimes you're just going to lose. And sometimes you're going to win. Could Carvana make a comeback? If they get like, if they do better with their customer service and they, they're able to solve this problem with the tags and the titles, if they're able to solve those problems, I mean, Carvana could do good. It could make a comeback. But they keep going that the way that they're going. This company's gonna go bankrupt just like Blockbuster did. So I said I would never buy. I would never buy a car from Carvana, but doesn't mean I won't buy a stock. If Carvana goes under twenty dollars, I might buy me a share just to match around. I mean, when GameStop shares went down. I sold all my shares because I, I thought GameStop was finished. I sold almost like $4. How about that thing went up to like $300 in that year? <laughs> I was kicking myself in the foot because I missed out. I could have spent like $400 for 100 shares. Then I could have sold when it was like over $300. And I could would have had me enough to put down on the house on the home. But hey, how was I supposed to know it was on the shoot up to like three hundred dollars? So it's the same way Carvana. Is it a good buy or not? I mean I can't really tell you. Right now it looks like Carvana is finished, but I could be surprised. It could shoot up to seven hundred dollars. <laughs> it could happen. If you think Carvana is going to make a comeback, give me a, just leave comments if you think it's going to make a comeback. If you think Carvana is finished, that they're done, leave comments. I want to hear both sides. I want to hear both the ugly and the good of opinions of Carvana. My opinion, I mean, I kind of think that they're, that they're done. It looks like they're done, but who knows? They could make come come back. But that was what scared me away from Carvana is how hard it is to get like a title or a tag, whatever it was. So that kind of scared me away. P wink wink for a year. So they got something that need to work out. But if you like this video? Give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And that being said, have a good weekend. Bye for now.